Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today I have to show you an updated version of the LA item sorter, which most people probably will use for non-stackable items. Since my last video about this topic, from a couple of weeks ago there have been a few changes in the snapshots that allowed me to make this much more straightforward and faster version. But the most important change was that sound-based events are now um, processed at the end of the tick and not instantly during the tick. And this way also proximity is important. So I showed this setup already in the last snapshot video. We got two pistons that would get triggered in the same tick. And depending on the update order, still one of them would trigger first. And previously, the piston that would trigger first would activate both of the Skulk sensors here. And yeah, this was changed. Now the piston that is closer to the Skulk sensor would trigger it. Previously, it would get different output because yeah, the piston being further away would still trigger both of them. And then the redstone signal output would be a bit different. Yeah, but this was changed. And now the yeah, piston is closer to the Skulk sensor would activate it. And this change would also affect entities like the Warden or the LA. So now we trigger all of the node blocks here in the back in the same tick, and the LAs get correctly assigned to them. Previously was the issue that the node block that would get triggered first would assign all the LAs to them. Yeah, now with the change, it's much more straightforward. I was also curious if maybe something like a block event delay would have any effect on it. So we got the instant repeat in here. And it's definitely not the case as long as it's triggered in the same tick, then all the LAs get assigned correctly. A second change also allowed me to increase the speed of the simple LA item sorter because the LAs would now pick up items roughly every three seconds instead of five seconds. I also tested this exactly again and actually came to a conclusion, it's not exactly three seconds, it's 3.1 seconds or 62 game ticks. Why it's not 60 exactly, I don't really know. Just did some practical test or empirical testing here. Um, so the test I did was here, we got a 60 tick clock. So 14 redstone ticks of repeated delay and one redstone tick of comparative delay. So this makes a 60 tick clock. Just kind of trigger no block real quick. And now this would spit out an item every 60 ticks. You can see the first item was picked up immediately and now we already get a little bit more delay between the LA picking up the items you can see here. That's it is also with a command block and turns out the LA can pick up the item every 62 ticks. All right, so out of convenience, I just use a 64 tick comparator clock here. Uh, let's test out the system. So here I have a box with all the different colored beds. You can just place it on top here. So there we go. It would trigger all of the node blocks immediately, so all the LAs get assigned correctly to it. And there's also a clock that keeps triggering the node blocks uh, I think every 10 or 15 seconds. Could be up to 30 seconds in between. So, so technically, after the first initial assignment, not necessary to keep using the instant line. You could also use an observer line like this here to trigger the node blocks. Um, because the lays will stay assigned correctly to the node blocks. All right, we can already see that the bats are being picked up. Also, yeah, put some colored concrete blocks here at the bottom. Items are still getting sorted, but as you can see here, they put it in correctly. Okay, let's do a quick tick bob, and then we can see each chest is exactly one of the, the colored non-stackable bats. Also, tried this out with. Um, a lot of the same item types to see if the 64 tick clock is really reliable. And let's do a quick tick pop again. You can see the last delay picked up the 18 bats correct. All right, so the conclusion of this test is that LA item sorting is now a lot more straightforward, especially the assignment to the note blocks doesn't cause as much of a headache anymore. All right, thanks guys for watching and see you next time. Bye bye.